take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. In chemistry, the mole is a unit used to talk about atoms. It is similar to other units we use every day. For example, you might walk into the local donut shop and order a dozen donuts. In doing so, you know that you will get 12 of these snacks and the clerk knows to give you 12.22 October 2018. Take our lead. The mole is the base unit of amount of substance, number of substance, in the International System of Units, SI, defined as exactly 6.0221407 times 1023 particles, e.g., atoms, molecules, ions or electrons. Thus, for example, one mole of magnesium bromide is one gram molecule of magnesium bromide but three gram atoms of magnesium bromide.17 June 2019. Let's help you make your mark. Quantities of substances can be related to each other using balanced chemical equations. The mole is a key unit in chemistry. Balanced chemical reactions are balanced in terms of moles. A balanced chemical reaction gives equivalences in moles that allow stoichiometry calculations to be performed. 22 January 2021. Let's help you make your mark. A mole corresponds to the mass of a substance that contains 6.023 x1023 particles of the substance. The mole is the SI unit for the amount of a substance. Its symbol is mole. By definition, one mole of carbon-12 has a mass of 12 grams and contains 6.022140857 x1023 of carbon atoms to 10 significant figures. Examples Make your mark, take our lead. The identity of a substance is defined not only by the types of atoms or ions it contains, but by the quantity of each type of atom or ion. For example, water H2O, and hydrogen peroxide H2O2, are alike in that their respective molecules are composed of hydrogen and oxygen atoms. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.